Today's acrylic pour painting is remarkable. I am so in love with the colors. That dioxidine purple, oh my goodness, it's stunning. I decided to use the same colors to do a Dutch pour and a Dahlia painting. One canvas, two techniques. Guys, check out today's video. I'm pretty sure you're gonna enjoy this one. I love it and I really do hope that you all love it too. Hello everyone, how you all doing? This is your girl Camille, welcome back to my channel. I wanna say thank you so much for being here. Guys, you know what? My video number 92, uh, my half of a Dahlia, um, was such a success for me and um, you know I had so many people uh, talking about it and they really enjoy uh, my creativity and all that and I'm happy that I'm able to encourage uh, someone to you know to think outside the box and just to try something different so guys today I am back to do a combination of techniques so i'll be doing a dutch pour and i'll be combining that with my dahlia flowery swiping that with the spoon all right guys the colors i chose today oh my goodness i gotta say the colors blew me away like i mean I'm, i was so amazed the purple that dioxidine purple i i just i was just in awe um you know i know it dries dark you know but based on how you use it but when i mix the purple with the blue and the magenta oh my gosh guys i'm telling you those are just amazing color combination and you know i'm just playing around with colors and i just love to combine different colors just to see the outcome and i'm just happy i'm happy i went with that magenta to add that with the dioxidine purple so guys i want you to check out today's technique you know i'm still getting used to the blow dryer technique and all that guys you know i've done it um when i just uh, started my youtube channel but i haven't done that much so you know bear with me and, and i do hope you love it so and of course guys the colors i'm using the name of the, the name the brand name will be listed in the description box below so i want you guys to check that out as well all right guys so let me say again thank you thank you thank you for all my new viewers all my subscribers really really do appreciate your support your kindness i really do appreciate it guys you know and um and of course give me a thumbs up if you do like this one okay and go ahead and uh, share it with your friends and family you know that helps my youtube channel going all right so i want to say thank you so much and of course my, all my returning uh, uh viewers if you haven't subscribed as yet i hope today will be the day that you decided to subscribe to my channel and of course don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on more fun videos for the dutch pour technique i usually add uh the, the white base color that i'm using um around the colors that i'm gonna blow out just to act as a flow extender i just want when i blow that out it gives you that nice frill um you know a ribbon like look it's just beautiful and i do love how the colors blended well together i mean it's just look like um it's an alcohol painting you know like I have, I have not tried that technique, but I've watched videos on alcohol painting and I mean, it's just amazing. I think that's one thing I'm going to try in the future. What do you guys think? <laughs> so yes, guys, go ahead and um, enjoy today's video. And of course, I will see you for the close up of the wet result and the dry result at the end. So guys, don't go away. Stay with me to the end. Thank you. For all my new viewers, um, I just want to mention that if you have missed my video number 78, my purple dahlia, or my video number 76, my white dahlia, um, where I do explain in depth, um, you know, more detail of how to swipe with a spoon, 
um, if not guys I'll just share that you know each time you swipe with the spoon uh, make sure that you wipe that spoon clean you just want to have a clean spoon each time you swipe and of course my consistency for my paint how I, how I do mix it uh, my ingredients it's also in my description box below you guys can check that out and I did I do want to mention uh, as well that the size canvas I'm using for today's painting is a 16 by 20 inch gala wrap canvas and of course all my paintings are available for purchase if you guys are interested you guys can email me at camilleamoy at gmail.com or you can follow me on my Instagram Camille Amoy, uh, sorry, camille.amoy.art on my IG. Okay, guys, so you can find me on Facebook as well. All that detail is, all that information is in my description box below. All right, guys, so enjoy today's show. And um, of course, see you for the close up of the wet result and the dried result.
Here it is guys, the close-up of the wet result. Guys, check out the colors. Check out that purple mixed with the magenta and the blue. Perfect color combination guys, wouldn't you think? I do love it. I am, I'm just amazed. It's beautiful, it's stunning. The colors blended well together. I just love the fluid art. Can I tell you guys how much I love the fluid art? I mean, it's just a beautiful, beautiful way of expressing yourself through colors. Oh my gosh, I, I'm just in love. I love this piece. And for the Dutch pour, I did add some gold to that. I mean, it's just amazing, guys. And when this get a coat of resin, the colors are gonna pop. It's gonna just shine. It's gonna shimmer. That gold is just amazing in this piece. All right, guys. So let me know what you have to say about this one in the comment section below. Let me know, guys. Um, you know, for the dahlia flower, I only added two layers. So, because it's a small flower for this um canvas, I really want to add it too. So it's beautiful. What do you guys have to say about this one? Leave me a comment in the comment section below. Give me a thumbs up, guys. Here is a dried result. It dried well. It dried just the way I left it when it was wet, guys. No shifting, no changes. It's just beautiful. I love the Dutch pour. I just love how the colors blended well. It's just amazing. You know, I'm just speechless. I 
you know like i said before guys i just love the fluid art you know it's just a way of expressing yourself through colors and um, this one speaks to me i don't know like i just love when i was swiping the dahlias with a spoon and i could see all the gradients of colors all the colors i add to that it makes well so i'm happy and of course with the dutch pour i just love how bright it is and like i said before in the beginning it kind of remind me of alcohol ink painting so maybe i'm just being weird <laughs> but you know this art is a weird art right so i love it all right guys i do hope you enjoy today's painting let me know how you feel about this one will this be something that you guys are going to try you know if you if you decide to give the dahlia painting with a spoon a try guys you know maybe you don't have to add you know that much layer to make it so complicated maybe you could try the two layers and then work your way from there because i do want you guys to give it a try and have some fun and please do not get too frustrated i know all right guys so i will see you on my next video check out my playlist and i will see you guys next time bye